fourth graders. Welcome to our social studies lesson for today. Today we are looking at Northwest Native American art and design. Here's our learning target. I can identify, appreciate, and create Northwest Native American art and design. Notice there are three verbs here. Identify. First, we need to be able to see it and know what it is. Then we need to be able to appreciate it, see it, and love it for what it is. And then we're going to create it. We're going to make our own. Let's dive in. Much of the Northwest Coast art is representational. The images represent animals and figures from stories and legends. There are many tribes in the Northwest and they, have, and they all have different styles. They all have different art styles. The work of the artists from Haida and other First Nations communities use form line, ovoids, ovoids, and U forms to create their designs. And the Coast Salish art appears more minimalist with less focus on detail and pattern and more on round edges and expressive faces. We're going to dive into this soon. Coast Salish art can generally be recognized by small round eyes in circular faces and simplified human figures. So form line, ovoids, U-form, we're going to talk about all these things. Here's form line design, which is something we are more um, used to seeing around here with Northwest art. This is an ovoid shape kind of like an oval, and these are the U-forms, kind of scoops. There are two kinds of space. There's positive and negative. Positive spaces are those occupied by the main subjects of work, and negative spaces are the areas around and behind the positive spaces. Negative space can also be referred to as the background or what has been cut away. So, when we think about coast sail Coastal Salish art, most of their art they did through carving. So, when we think about it, we need to really think about what they had cut away. And those are the shapes that we see most often. And you keep seeing kind of the same, the similar swoops and swirls and lines. What has been cut away and what is still there? Go ahead and click on the next slide to learn more. <clears throat> 